time to scour the vintage world in the middle of the night. We'll hit you back up when the sun comes out in a little bit. Ricky, you want to see the cassettes I found? You ready? ACDC, Ooh, nice. Guns N' Roses, Ooh. Poison, uh. Jurassic Park playing cards, and Billy the Kid. It's a box full of like little vintage handheld keychains. You got Simon, you got the match game, casino slots. You got things that look like friggin' pagers. Anything really cool in here? I'll let you know if I find something like Konami or something. Ooh, Radio Shack. Why does Radio Shack ask for your phone number when you buy batteries? I was looking at some old shirts and I was super stoked. This old giant hat, which if you don't know is a really great brand for shirts back in the day. But look! A Winston Racing, let's go. Along with some single stitch. So I put Ricky in charge of asking for a price for me and I walked over and he's completely distracted looking at games, which I don't blame you. How much were the games? He's pulling to the side for something. Oh, got it. Look at this, bro. If there's any book in the world you gotta buy, it's gotta be Hulk Hogan, Hollywood, baby. Get the priorities in order, man. Wayne's World Party Time Excellent. Oh, wow, that's sick, Ricky, actually. Look at this too. Some uh, new family guys. Oh, look at this head, bro. It's a nice head, bro. It's like honestly the same size as your head. That's kind of weird. My head's pretty big. Roscoe, my boy, with the purchase. Let's see. What'd you get? Show me. Roach. You too, bro. Thank you. You got a. Oh, dude. A sexy. I actually think that's really 1993. Cool. It's got the. It's got the skunk on there. Hey, but skunk, skunk makes and the it funk. something. It does, it does. What do we got here? We got some Atari stuff in here. Wow, you don't see it very often. You got yard, okay, so you got a bunch of games. I don't even know, bro. I'd have to, it'd be like completely, open this up, Ricky. I got one hand in here, my guy. What we got? Show me some of the, some of the games right here. All right, here we go. We got Galaxian. Galaxian. We got. We got Berserk, Berserk baby. That's a good one. That is a good one. Telly games, Pac-Man, Super, ooh, Superman. Baby, look at that. Have you ever played this one? Superman. I'm gonna pretend. I'm gonna pretend like I have, but I haven't. <laughs> Dang, Pac. So there's a whole bunch of stuff. Reactor, comp. Oh gosh. He's crazy. What do you think? What, what's your? What, what do you think it is? Rick, or you what offer? Would you make on this? So I don't know anything about Atari enough to make any sort of offer. In my brain, again, not knowing Atari, I was like around like 80 bucks in my head. So we'll see. Maybe we'll go back later. So this booth, yeah, is just filled with a lot of big box games and stuff down here. The old homie, I like games one, two, three. What was it, episode three back in the day of original Retro Liberty? Man, I don't remember. It's <laughs> it, so long ago. It's been too long. Still out here on the hunt. Yeah, nothing. I don't. I don't know anything about this big box stuff except this one, Fitness Solutions. That I could understand. Yeah, nothing like a good crunch in them. Oh yeah. Oh, get it, baby. I was excited. I finally found two games I wanted. Let's see. Ready. Oh, pity. Oh, don't worry. Blitz 2003 is going to have the good go. Roscoe, you bought Yo, some bro. Raiders thingies? Yeah, dude, I bought a couple of these old Raider, Los Angeles Raiders cuffs, man. You know why? Because the Raider Nation goes thick and hard. Ew. <laughs> Look at this Master Chief Halo Wall Light. How much is this guy? Five bucks. Five bucks, I'm in. I'll take this for sure. And then right after that, he said five bucks for any of these ones. Ooh, even the Power Rangers. Are these ones? No, these are the remakes, right? I will find out shortly. Yeah, they're the remakes, but still five bucks each. I think I'm gonna get the Power Ranger one and the Spider-Man one. Super cool for five bucks. Oh my, 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 my. All right, I think at that, um, we got the Mario one right here. I'll explain later, guys, for you guys listening. They're all the Power A controllers. You got the Link one, you got the Hyrule one, you got the Pikachu one. Um, I'm gonna tell you guys in a minute why I'm picking up a ton of these, but I'm gonna grab some right now. So this is why I say it's important to be cool with vendors. I don't even think he knows that we have a show, so to say, but he was like, dude, you buy stuff for me all the time. I sell these for 15 each, 15 to 20, depending. He's like, bro, you're here all the time. I will sell them to you for $5 each. I'm grabbing a bunch. Just for the heck of it. Ricky, heads or tails, you win. I'm giving you $100 cash. All right. Tails never fails. Oh, wow. Stupid Ricky. Look at this squad, y'all. Look at this. Look at the squad behind me right now. This is like, oh, hello. Hello. Who is phone it? call, phone call. I'm gonna be honest. Don't please nobody get mad. Did you purposely do that like Asian? <laughs> you, said, phone, this you, said, you said phone call, phone call. <laughs> That's racist. That's racist. But check it out, there it is, guys. The cart is officially filling up. Thank goodness. You underestimate the power. 
on the dark side. Ricky is desperately looking for a VHS player, by the way. A VHS player. That is the goal of the day. How much is that wheelie over there, though, Ricky? I don't know. He's asking about it. Nice. Look at him over there. He's shagging over there. <laughs> What's this guy got? <laughs> Porridge for supper? Porridge for a spoon? <laughs> oh Ricky, look. It's our comment section on our old videos. <laughs> <laughs> Halloween costumes are $2 each. I mean, I think I'm just gonna buy these Halo ones just to have them. There's a few of them lying around. I'm gonna buy two of them. Team Disney from 1996? What? With all the cool embroideries on the back and stuff? I'm 100% buying this. This is a, a freaking dollar. Team Disney 96. Ricky, you know the drill. What do I get if I make it in? Come on. 100 bucks. My 100 bucks back? 100 bucks. All right. Oh no, look, she almost caught it. <laughs> nice try, nice try. <laughs> well, yep, 50 cents, I'm in. Holy oh, moly, Ricky. Like Cobra from my <laughs> horrible lighting, horrible angle, I'm in my kids' rooms. I know, I had to jump in and say this, but what you're about to see is us finding something crazy. And this, if you've been watching the channel, we recently posted a video where we went over some old animation cells we found in old animation drawings which became bigger than life and bigger than we could have expected on the channel. Um, these things have kind of become known in the community as not just one of the biggest things we've ever found, but one of the biggest things found, some say, in YouTube and gaming, this or that. This is the early stages of it, so it'll make sense, maybe not right now, but as the weeks go on and we find more and more, you'll see it. But I just wanted to make it clear, this is the early stages of that where it all comes into play. I just spotted something that I'm freaking out about. Ricky, watch out, bro, I'm sorry. Look at this. Holy freaking crap. Are you kidding me? Billy Lee, oh my God. Oh my, there is no limit. Oh my gosh. So this is like all old like animation films. You got Tiny Toons. What is that? Rainbow, okay, I gotta see on this Double Dragon one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's two of them. Oh my gosh, wait, both book one of two? So yeah, after looking at these, I think this is like the coolest thing I've found in, 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 my, in the last 20 years. I'm gonna be honest. Well, 10 years of game hunting, but I've been looking longer. I, I can't even, I'm like quiet right now because of this. It's the freaking models of all their stuff. From the part from the cartoons, all the artwork and everything even shows the finals, uh, the, the revised finals, the yeah, artwork. Oh there. my gosh! I mean, look, yeah, I have to, I have to. I, I'm, I'm like silent for the first time in my life. We're doing it. Ricky and I are buying the only copies yeah. that are available. There you go. I got the two. Okay. And then and I think he's, the he's going to get the other two. Okay. Thank you. I mean, I have to show this in greater detail. This is one of the cool, so Deke is one of actually my favorite animation slash history part of nostalgia when it comes to old cartoons. But when we found the Deke, I saw Deke from far away and I was like, oh my gosh, Ricky, they got Deke. Well, I didn't say it. I thought in my breath. And I looked over, I'm like, out of all the Deke animated, it's freaking Double Dragon. And I was like, what are the odds? So we start going through this stuff and it's literally all the revisions and finals of how they made every single, look at this. Beautiful. It tells you exactly what is the it, maybe the internals or uh, the cavern of fungus. Everything is in here. Look at this, Ricky. Watch. You got the you got the sketch work right there with the finals. Oh my gosh! It, this is all the other characters on the other page. Was more of like the Billy and Jimmy. You got Shadow and different characters. But I mean, oh look, and then look at you can see the final Ricky and then the product getting into work. I mean, it's just that's this dope. is the definition of a piece of history. I mean, How you feeling? Honestly, for the first time in a long time, I was actually speechless. And I literally said to myself, which I probably, hopefully didn't say too loud, I literally whispered to myself, there is no price. Like almost like whatever he said, I was gonna be like, okay. They said 100 and then he went down to 80 without me even saying, I was speechless. Maybe my speechless finally paid off. What's what's happening over here? What are you guys doing over here? <laughs> what are you showing me, Ricky? Oh, little Nemo animation cell. That is freaking sick, cool is that? dude. That is so cool, I love that. And I'm picking up these three games for 10 buckaroonies. Not bad. All right, inside scoop. I'll, I'll monitor, I'll change your voice. Where did that stuff come from, the Double Dragon School? Well, it came from a producer that uh, ended up losing a storage unit. If a lady didn't have a uh, uh, Vince's toy store, she ended up buying the whole unit. And then 
she ended up selling it to him because she was just paying too much for the yield. Our homie said he was literally behind us while we were looking at those books, just waiting for us to put them down, but we, we obviously didn't. All right, I know, Roscoe, sometimes we find things that are like really rare. This is a hymnal, right? But it's the choir director's copy. Dude, how much? They have the new Aladdin. Prince Ali, fabulous. Ricky, give us a snap and let's see what happens. Dude, this thing's hard. So we're back at that booth now that we know it was from like a production person who worked on at, you know, multiple different lots. Look at this one, Sabrina. Obviously, I think we got the Holy Grail with um, Double Dragon. These are kind of the ones that are leftovers after a lot of people have been through here. But there's still some cool ones like Fear.com with like original, you know, light script work. We got the most detailed, best ones there is. And Double Dragon, I can't get over it. Oh, Aquaman. Oh, Ricky just spotted this one. The whole nine yards. These are original reels. This is Once in a Life. There's a Bumblebee movie, The In-Laws. Nothing that like, you know, would have been up our alley, but still cool. I mean, this kind of stuff I could look through for hours. Ricky, oh, there he is. Look at this, Ricky, but check this out. What is it? It's the, uh, Brave little toaster one you said, but look, this is uh, re reused, reissued, or refused. Revised. Revised. Oh, I can't read. Wow. Today, Junior. Can't read. Revised with the title change and credit change. I mean, that is just the coolest little wizard story. This is like it's the master. Here's another brave little toaster one right here. It's funny. Just like a week and a half ago, I was talking with Mikey about how the brave little toaster is one of my favorite movies, and he'd never seen it. I did end up picking up this. I think it is one of the coolest pieces of history you could find. Brave Little Toaster. Um, this is when they did the title change to Brave Little Toaster to the rescue, credit change, all that stuff. I mean, this kind of stuff just, it literally doesn't exist. This is the only stuff in existence of the original when it was done for the production company. So I am just feeling on a cloud nine right now. So I had to pick up the other two. This is one of two, two of two. And the reason I wanted this one, it's also Brave Little Toaster, but on the top it says final pick. So this other one I got says like when they were revising like the titles and the credits, and then this one says final. So I think I got like this full set of like revising it to the final pick, freaking unreal. What are you gonna watch them on? Uh, your mom. Burn! Notre Dame hat is actually sick, but then they got this Roscoe hat. What? Big Daddy. Just been digging through these hats for like 20 minutes and found three that I really like. I love these McDonald's freaking combo with Dr. Pepper Monopoly hats, vintage, super rad, and a roach, Planet Hollywood, but I'll get this also. <laughs> Intercourse, Pennsylvania. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, here's a thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hmm. He said a dollar because it's untested and looks broken. I'm gonna take it for a buck. Roscoe. Yeah. What do you man. think about the fact that I just got a PlayStation 2 for a dollar? Untested. Untested. Unbelievable, man. Wow, I cannot actually believe that. I just walked over to this pile of VHS, and what's funny, it was, well, first of all, Roscoe found this Mortal Kombat animated series video. Definitely gonna get this. But just last night, my kids and I were looking for Ichabod Crane, Legend of Sleepy Hollow, but we don't have Disney Plus. And here it is, just like that the power of physical media. Even the DVDs are a great selection. Super Mario Bros, Super Show, Box Office Mario, Ninja Turtles, and Mortal Kombat, and Little Monsters. Alrighty, 50 cents by the way. Huh, oh, oh, gosh, oh. So Ricky just had to leave, he took a bunch of my stuff, but I still can't believe some of the stuff we found. I think the best item by far was all the old animation studio stuff, like the Brave Little Toaster, and the biggest would obviously be the Deke animated lots for the Double Dragon stuff. That's just unbelievable to me, the greatest finds. Uh, some of my friends that I sent them to was like, dude, that's the coolest stuff you've ever found in your life. So I don't know, you tell me. Talk to you guys later. I'm so excited for Miss Tonight.